Decret leave, pandemic restrictions, remote working husband, all these turn my life into something dull and monotonous. The news of a meetup with my high school friends stirred me up. You're so excited. It's like you're expecting a lover around the corner. My husband joked that day. He couldn't have guessed that the mother of an 11 month old son would lose her composure after a meeting with some old classmates. Once upon a time, I was infatuated with a boy who sat behind me in class. I remember styling my hair differently every day just to catch his eye. One day, I heard a voice from behind. That's the prettiest one. Go for that style. Our school crush never blossomed into anything, but even in college, I often reminisced about that guy. We never interacted after school, though there were plenty of opportunities. At the class reunion, at least half the class showed up. We were seated far apart, yet our gazes met for a moment and a shiver ran down my spine. From that moment on, I was convinced there would be some sort of continuation. And indeed there was. The only option for our meetings was hourly rate hotels. The first time, it was embarrassing to go there, but I wanted it so much. He had a family, two kids. I had a husband and a little son, whom I had to leave with a relative whenever I needed to be away. I twisted the truth like a snake on hot coals. For a woman on maternity leave, this was an incredibly tough task. The affair lasted several months. During this time, I lost over 10 kilograms and felt incredibly attractive. My husband complimented me, saying that motherhood suited me. It's strange how he didn't notice the obvious. Maybe I was so audacious in my cheating then he couldn't have fathomed his wife capable of it. It was the lover who suggested ending our encounters, something I hadn't expected at all and was initially even offended by. His wife turned out to be more perceptive than my spouse and grew suspicious. I had to draw the line. Yes, after some time, he called and proposed meeting again, but by then, I had cooled off. Do I regret it? In a way, yes, because infidelity is despicable, and I admit that. On the other hand, I console myself with the thought that without this episode, I probably wouldn't have shed the extra weight so quickly. And I looked at my husband with different eyes. 